Dear friends, I am very happy to share with you my vocation story. Let me begin by introducing myself. I am Deacon Pawanjit Singh SDB. I belong to the Salation province of Kolkata. I come from a very traditional village in the state of Punjab. To my knowledge, I am the first Punjabi Salation. How did I get my vocation? Dear friends, I did not have a particular interest to become a priest. But God has his plan for me. It was back in 2003 when my parish organized the first ever youth group under the guidance of Reverend Father John Iria Kunal, my parish priest. And I was chosen to lead the group when I was about 15 or 16. To work with and for the young became my passion. And in all this, Father John was my guide and my mentor. His work so inspired me that I felt and I started thinking of becoming a priest. In, on one evening in the month of August 2005, Father John came to my village and he called me and he asked, Pavan, do you want to go to Kolkata and become a priest? Without giving much thought to that, I said yes. Not so much that I wanted to become a priest, but because I wanted to see Eden Garden, the biggest cricket ground. And also I thought in Kolkata I could meet Saurav Gangoli, the cricket legend, because I was mad after cricket. But I believe God had different plans for me. How did I get my oscillation occasion? And why did I join Don Bosco? My dear friends, for me too, it is still a mystery. There was not the least possibility for me that I could have known the Salations because the Salations do not have any concrete presence in the state of Punjab and much less in the interior districts where I come from and my parish. For Jude Sebastian, a Salation priest from the province of Kolkata came to Punjab to visit some of his friends. And his friend's house is about four hours drive from my house. And his friends were friends of my parish priest, Father John. So they came to visit Father John. And that's how Father Jude began a conversation. He expressed that he would like to take some voice to become Salations. Then my parish priest introduced me to Reverend Father Jude Sebastian. And the only question Father Jude asked me was, What is your name? And I said, My name is Pavanjit. I had no vocation camp, no selection camp, and even I reached two or three months late to the seminary. And later on, I asked one day Father Jude, I asked, Father, why did you call me only by my name? And he said, Pavanjit, you should feel that God has called you by your name. Dear friends, to convince my parents that I want to become a priest and go far away from the family was one of my greatest struggle. That's a different part of my vocation story. I can share it later. When the Salation life began, we were three from Punjab and we stepped in the Salation house on the 5th of September 2005 in West Bengal. The first few months, my dear friends, were really agonizing. Everything looked a struggle. The people, the place, the language, the timetable, the food, everything was a struggle. My two other companions left after one year and I became even lonelier and I was the only Punjabi left. But all these struggles were nothing compared to the formation that I received and the happy memories I have with the Salations. First of all, I was impressed by the Salation presence. The fathers and the brothers, they all joined us in our prayers, in our games, work, fun. This was a indeed very, very positive impression in my life. Secondly, 
I was given ample opportunities to develop myself, to develop my talents in games, in studies, in music, in art and so on. What I am today, I can tell you my dear friends, is because of the Salation Formation I received. Thirdly, the work of the Salations for the young people is perhaps for me the greatest attraction. I loved working with the young and the Salation congregation was a perfect place for me. I am slowly realizing that God has brought me to the Salation congregation for a very, very specific purpose. I can never imagine that a boy of 16 from a very interior village back in Punjab could ever be a part of the family of Don Bosco that has spread across the world. Dear friends, I can tell you that I am so grateful to God that I am a Salesian and soon I will be a Salesian priest. God has given me the greatest vocation to serve his people as a Salesian in Don Bosco's way. Let us be open to the plan and will of God and we will see what miracles are. Thank you for listening.